Okay, today I'm shouting a bit louder because it's windy and I want to make sure you can hear me. Okay, so today I'm going to change up my training a little bit, mix it up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do one 20 minute round working the heavy back. One 20 minute round, okay? What this is used for, what you do this 20 minute round for, is to test your boxing skills, okay? Test a few things. One, your fitness, okay? Your sharpness, your endurance, your combinations, your variety of different techniques and footwork and slipping and combinations. Okay, so you're going to do a 20 minute round on this bag. Okay, and you're going to see when you start losing your sharpness. When do you start losing the snap on your punches? When do you start breathing harder? When do you start slowing down? When does your punches start to get a bit slower? You know, when... Okay, so you're just going to... It's good if you've got a coach to watch you while we do this. If not, you can record it on a video and you can watch yourself. Because you'll start off, okay, and then you'll start to get quite sharp and get into it. Okay, and then you might uh, start slowing down. You might start running out of, You might realize that you don't know as much combinations as you think you know. Your techniques, you might start losing a bit of variety. You might do the same thing all the time. It's good to view yourself. Do a 20 minute round on that bag, record it, and watch yourself. See when you start getting tired. See when you start losing your sharpness in your punches, okay? See if you keep repeating the same habits and the same combinations over and over and over again. You're not mixing it up enough, okay? So, I'm going to do that, I'll record it now, okay, and I'm going to see how I get on. It's a good fitness test, it's a good endurance test, technique, everything, okay? The 20 minute heavy bag boxing room. Okay, you want to work at a good pace because then you'll see when you start slowing down. This is a much better drill for professional boxers. I'm 10 minutes, 10 minutes into the workout. My combinations are going well, I'm using plenty of variety, different things. Okay. Making sure that I'm not doing the same thing all the time. I'm mixing it up. I'm not doing the same thing all the time. Plenty of, plenty of different things. Working lots of skills, okay? I'm still sharp. My power has warmed up now. Power up. The only thing I'm finding is that Effortless. I have to. I have to force myself to work a bit more. So definitely tire me out a bit. But I seem to be peaking for ten minutes. Okay. energy to do what I want to do so I can feel my breathing and my fitness is starting to starting to kick in now this is where my fitness is kicking, starting to feel it my power is good my technique is good but I'm getting tired and I'm, I'm breathing harder that's 15 minutes I've got five minutes left okay, okay. So the bell just went, that's been 20 minutes, okay, so what I feel, okay, I 
after 20 minutes, I've got, I've got max power. Yeah, my power seems to be really good, but I'm, I'm a lot slower. I don't have that snap anymore, and I have to work a lot harder, okay? I have to force myself harder to do the work. And another thing that I noticed in the last five minutes of the 20 minute round is my combinations. I started to do the same thing over and over again. Okay. I started running out of combinations to do. So I tended to just slow down and throw big body shots. I tended to just do the same thing, okay? I stopped using my creativity, my, my counter punching and my movement. And I, and I got stuck into the habits of doing the same combination over again and focusing more on power and not sharpness and speed and snap, okay? So by analysing myself how it worked that 20 minute round, I started off nice and sharp and I didn't, didn't waste any energy. And after about five, 10 minutes, it started costing me more energy to work, but my technique got a lot better. My power started to kick in, okay? After 15 minutes, started losing a bit of snap, losing a bit of creativity, and I was just doing the same combinations a lot, okay? So, in my fitness, after 15 minutes, I felt my breathing going up a bit, so that's where I need to work on my cardio, okay? So now I know, I can go back to training, do much more rounds, shadow boxing on the bags, I can do some more cardio, I can do running, swimming, to build the tank up a bit more, and I can also be a bit more creative with my combinations, my movement, my head movement, my counter punching, trying, for 20 minutes, keep that combination as varied and unpredictable as possible. So, it's a good way to judge, to measure your boxing. Measure your habits, your patterns, when you get tired, how fit you are, stuff like that, okay? You can record yourself, see for yourself. Also, you can do a 20 minute sparring round as well. It doesn't just have to be the bag. So, you can spar for 20 minutes, have your coach watch you and the other guy, and then notice when you start getting tired, when you start, getting sloppy and losing your sharpness, okay? When you start running out of creative combinations uh, and stuff like that. So the 20 minute heavy bag round, there you go. You can also do it in sparring. Give it a go, mix your training up, try something new. Ooh, 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 ooh.